Hello guys, we are back with our next tutorial. In this tutorial, let us go through file operations. So basically, there are totally six operations which we can do on files, guys. So the first thing is creating a file. So I think everyone knows how we can create a file or folder or anything. So when a new file is created by user, he need to do two operations. He will be doing indirectly. So it allocates the few space for that particular file in some uh, some location and it inserts a new entry in the directory table for this file so basically directory is nothing but a folder guys if you ask someone what is a directory directory you can file it call it as a drive will also be sometimes called as a directory and even a small folders which in which we store files is nothing but a directory so each directory will be having its own table which consists of what are the files in it and all the attributes which we have discussed in our last tutorial so when you create it it will be updated in there and some space will be allocated for your memory in memory location for your particular file fine and write a file to write data into the file so in some languages and somewhere we can do in this way write of the file name comma the string which we need to write so reading a file to read a particular file we can use this read of a a is nothing but your file name seek time seek time is nothing but the minimum time of response the file opening response or anything response guys file operation time opening time fine for for responding for the current file position okay for let us assume that the pointer is locating to some abc file and now it should change to our file that is nothing but a so the time taken for this changing of the pointer location from here to here is nothing your response time in our words we can say that that is nothing but your file opening time fine okay so further continuing deleting a file so we can delete a particular file and truncating a file so there is a small difference between delete and truncate guys so delete means you will be deleting the whole file whereas truncate means you delete the content of the file and you keep the attributes the same fine so i hope everyone got a small idea on this so in the next tutorial we'll be going through open file table guys so let us meet in the next tutorial thank you thanks for watching